considered a virtual make or break meeting for the future of India's boxers. After some initial hiccups, the officials finally getting their act together as a deadline to save Indian boxing from the doom and gloom of Olympic exile nears. It was a fiery start to a crucial meeting that would decide the future of Indian boxing. But a date finally set to officially form the Boxing Federation of India. After much haggling and protests here in Kolkata, officials finally set a date for elections. In a letter to the international body, the House has suggested the 8th of May, that is just six days before India's deadline to set our house in order, runs out. It puts its Sami is Shiva Thapa, India's lone boxer to qualify for the Rio Olympics and the others fighting for qualification. Yet if the process fails, India's boxers know they will have to be mere spectators at the Rio Olympics and other international events, putting their futures yet again in jeopardy. We are sure that we are going to present you a national body before 14. And we are guarantee you Indian boxer will pay under the banner of India. There was no compromise. But strangely, the Indian Olympic Association continues to sit in Abhay Chautala's corner, the man whose re-election to the boxing body in 2012 sent the sport into the doldrums. A fresh election should be held. We are not objecting to that. So IO is not a way any obstruction. But till, till the elections are held, from our side, we recognize the old body. In 2008, it was Vijayendra Singh. In 2012, it was Mary Com. With elections now scheduled for May, their Olympic dream is alive. With Karishma Singh in New Delhi and Jayanta Bhattacharya in Kolkata, Viren Farao Times now.